Diva Singo clan, which originated from the Chwes clan, are scattered all over in Buganda, Binyoro, Toro, and Ankole, and it's believed that some have migrated in Rwanda and Burundi. But what worries most is the trend of embracing the Western culture at the expense of their ancient traditional norms. Enoch says that many people say that Basingo have bad omen, yet when you go to the bank, they'll ask for security, which is Omsingo in Runyankore. But Omsingo, in the essence, or in the real essence, is a person who has his property, who has wisdom, who has wealth. That's why when you go to the bank, they ask you for Omsingo. They don't ask for any other thing. Enok Nimpamia in his early 40s, residing in Kampala and the chairman for Basingo, recalls how his grandparents used to do perform culture norms as a way of embracing their culture. They had a lot of powers. Did you know that they were flying human beings in the Chinese Empire? And most of them were Basingo. Did you know that before a function was made, say a battle, before a battle started, a Musingo had to perform his rituals? and the other practices, and then he declares it is worth fighting the war or not fighting the war. Most of the command, commanders, where they were single, you've even heard of the Bajendanwa Bayurhanga, that is the royal drum in the Ankore kingdom. Who protected it? It was the Vasingo. My question to you is that, can you protect something that doesn't belong to you? It was the Vasingo who protected this drum, and this drum, of course, is to beat itself. You can't imagine this, the great power, the amazing the power that the Vasingo could have. Basingo are the ones that built Bigobia Mjenyi, located in Ntusi sub-county, which believed to have been the capital of Chitara or Bachwe's dynasty between 1000 to 1500 AD. Did you, for example, know that the Basingo are the ones who built the Bigobia Mjenyi? That is Mjenyi. Mjenyi was produced by Nyangoma. Who is Nyangoma? Who Nyangoma was a Musingo? Of course, all these were signs of um, Simba. Enoch says that Basingo discovered and introduced millet growing where cattle keepers and their beloved cow Bihogo contributed to the downfall of Chwe's empire. This cow which you hear itself, Bihogo, which contributed to the downfall of the Chwe's empire was the dear darling, beloved cow of the Basingo people. But this history has not been told or told to anybody to our generation up to date. The Basingo clan has prominent people like Peter Ture, Ephraim Kamontu, among others, and their wishes to see their clan as it used to be since it was a great clan. Babram Tyre, this is my story.